Okay, so now we're going to show you uh, the new version of Harry is actually the 430X. So he has the GPS uh, added to him. So we'll show you what that, how much that's helped us now since we've actually got uh, a GPS on the system. We can go into the app here, Husqvarna Connect. We can see that um, Harry is mowing at the moment. It's green. We can stop him from mowing or we can tell him to go and park in the station. So if we notice that he's stuck and he's not get, able to get himself out and I'm at work in the office, I can just at least turn him off so that his battery is not getting damaged. What else can we do here? Well, we can go here into the GPS and here is a picture of our plot. We can actually see with the red lines exactly where Harry has been working over the last hours. We can see he's been mostly at the back garden and he's been uh, working quite a lot on the hill, which is good. Um, we can also go here into settings and check how we've decided to put the timer. We're having him every day of the week between nine in the morning and six in the evening. We've decided not to have him running at night because uh, we do have a lot of hedgehogs in the, in the garden here and we don't want a problem with that. We can actually adjust the cutting height by just moving the slider here automatically, have him at two or at six or, or minimum. We've got him at a little bit higher at the moment, having him uh, around two has worked for us now when we're trying to get him to just chop up the leaves before the autumn. We can also decide whether he works to the weather timer or not. We're not using the weather timer at the moment because we noticed that he uh, was not cutting regularly enough. The high weeds were just um, not getting cut. And you can have a look at the installation settings. You've got a guide here of of which areas, if we've got different areas. We've only got one big area that um, Harry's taking both back gardens. And one of the other things you can see is what accessories are available. Um, and that he flashes when there's a fault and that he should avoid colliding with the mower house so that he feels that, that sense. So um, they're the main things that we, we use. Check that he's working. Have a look at what areas have been. Here's his charging station over here. And at the moment it's telling us that he's on top of the hill working, as we can see over here. And then the settings.